Every brother Let's call it in the crossfire Let's call it in the crossfire Hey guys, Trip with Stars of Iowa again here. We're gonna do a little shotgun review for you guys. So I wanted to start out with showing you guys just a regular average hunting gun. Make sure you can see all of it. Regular wooden stock, foregrip, three shells in the tube. And I wanted to show you the tactical at home defense gun that I made. This is a Remington 870, okay? I have the 18 inch barrel on it with the two shell extension. I opted to put a tack light on there because as I said, this was made for home defense. So I wanted to be able to see what I was shooting at and light it up pretty well. So then I've got a different synthetic foregrip on it. I have a tack rail with a red dot and the stock is actually a full stock, but it's a pistol grip. Put your thumb through it so you can hold it just like a pistol grip, but still have the control of having the stock. So the other cool part about the tack rail is that I don't have to use my red dot. Underneath here, there's a hole through there that I can still see my regular iron sights. So this holds six in the tube plus one in the chamber. So you got seven rounds. Then on the back of the stock here, I have, it was supposed to be like a cheek pad rest, but the main reason I have this here guys is for this little pouch. So I can have extra rounds. Um, on the outside of here, you can Velcro um, more shells that hold them right here. This one, the one reason I like it is because I can actually still use this to hunt in certain places as long as there's no restrictions on what size of barrel that you have to use. And it's a smooth bore with no choke. So I can shoot slugs out of it. I can shoot regular target or bird shot, double lot buck, stuff like that. The main thing I want to bring up about these guys as a home defense weapon is that you definitely want to make sure that if you have other people in your home, kids, family members, stuff like that, that you are aware of what round you're using and what it can do. If it can go through walls, if you miss, what room you're shooting at if you do have to use it, if you do have an intruder that breaks in. This is one thing that you have to think, for you personally, if you'd rather use a shotgun for at-home defense or something along the lines of a nine millimeter, a small handgun, stuff like that. So there's just a couple quick things to think about when you're going for an at-home defense weapon. So then a couple other things about it, guys. I've had this gun ever since I was in high school. Started out actually just like that one. Had regular where it only held three shells. I added on the two shell extension, the rail, all that stuff, switched the stock out. The stock, I really like. It is a Remington stock and it has a Remington Supercell pad on the back that with the pistol grip and the stock makes it really comfortable to shoot, really comfortable. I have people that didn't like shooting 12 gauges and then they shot this one with the pistol grip through it and the supercell pad on it and they loved it. It was so much more comfortable for them. I can't even begin to tell you guys how many rounds I put through this thing because I lost count and it has never failed me. I mean, yeah, obviously it's a pump. It's not an automatic shotgun, but I have never had anything on this gun fail me. Definitely, in my opinion, the best shotgun for anything that you can buy would be the Remington 870. Rather, you want to turn it into a hunting gun with a longer barrel 
or like this tactical for at home defense or a truck gun or anything multiple uses for this one guys multiple things and even if you have all this stuff you can still just swap out your barrel for your 27 28 whatever inch barrel that you want to get for it and still go hunting with it or bird whatever so definitely would suggest this for anybody too experienced people newbies anything good gun to definitely start with tear down i'm not going to do any of that stuff today disassemble or reassemble but it is really not hard guys we'll take you through that another time but other than that definitely definitely a great shotgun hope you guys enjoyed this one um if you haven't already check us out on facebook instagram or twitter and go ahead and leave a like comment subscribe if you haven't already and other than that guys that's all i got for you today so you guys have a good one later